If you're new to Formula One, you might have heard fans and commentators use the term DRS frequently throughout a race weekend. In this video, we'll break down what is DRS and how it works. Let's get started. DRS stands for Drag Reduction System and is a movable flap on the rear wing of an F1 car. Opening the flap reduces aerodynamic drag and makes it easier for the car to accelerate. The concept was introduced in 2011 to make overtaking easier. It is a controversial topic. While some see it as an essential weapon in a driver's arsenal, others believe it makes racing artificial. When DRS is enabled, the flap on the rear wing of the car opens and gives the pursuing car a speed increase of up to 20 km per hour. The use of DRS is restricted by F1 rules. It is only permitted when the following criteria are met. The following car is within one second of the car to be overtaken. Note that this includes cars being lapped. The following car is in an overtaking zone as defined by the FIA before the race. This overtaking zone is typically referred to as the DRS zone. DRS may not be activated on the first two laps after the race start, restart, or safety car deployment. The system cannot be used by the defending driver unless within one second of another car in front. In addition, DRS may not be enabled if racing conditions are deemed dangerous by the race director, such as in heavy rain. There are two or three DRS zones in each race. They are predefined and drawn on the circuit map and only occur on the straights. If you would like to learn more about F1 circuits, refer to my F1 circuits explained video linked in the description below. There is a line on the track to show the area where the one second proximity is being detected. This is known as the DRS detection point. A later line on the track known as the activation point shows when DRS can be enabled. There's also a sign on the track marked DRS where the DRS zone begins. Let's look at a video example to put it all together. Here you can see that Lewis Hamilton is racing Max Verstappen. Max Verstappen is ahead, but when Lewis Hamilton clears the DRS detection point, he is within one second of Max Verstappen. Now we can see Lewis crossing the DRS activation point. Since he was within one second of his competitor at the detection point, the flap on the rear wing of his car opens at the activation point, giving him extra speed for overtaking. A light on the steering wheel dashboard notifies the driver when DRS can be enabled. The driver then clicks the DRS button on his steering wheel and the flap on the rear wing of the car opens. The flap automatically closes when the driver touches the brake at the end of the straight. What are your thoughts about DRS? Do you feel it benefits the sport? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like this video and consider subscribing to the channel for more great Formula One content.